please donate, subscribe, and listen to the rest of this and watch Patrick Gossage because I'm going to put to him about the elections coming up, American election coming up in just a few weeks. Canadians wish they had an election. If my bet on Trudeau and his ego is such, we won't have an election for quite some time. But the politics in Canada are going to change after the American election, in your view. Oh. Well, I, the politics are so bad in this country. Oh, they're already bad then. And, and, you know, and they're going to get worse. It's going to be a disgusting election. There's going to be name calling like we've never seen. There's a huge division between the left and the right here. And interestingly enough, the, uh, the progressive parties, the NDP and the liberals, have 22% of the vote each. That's 44% together, and the, and the Tories have 44%. There's an absolute division, just the way there is. Everybody talks about the American election, how close it is. Our, uh, the division between the progressives and the, and the, and the um, conservatives. conservatives here are just as deep and just as close. Isn't that one of the problems, though? Because it used to be you know, the end dippers over here to the left, conservatives to the right, liberals in the middle, and there's so many liberals now, and I've known a lot of them in my years, they won't vote liberal because they say the Liberal Party is a progressive party. There's That's no true. party for the middle. And the, and the Tories are coming over towards the middle to take over that spot. Yeah, because I know. the Liberal Party has been, has been you know, screwed out by Trudeau. It's been eviscerated, really. And, uh, well, that's more articulate than I mean, mine. Uh, I'm just using the big words, you know, eviscerated. <laughs> but, uh, but, you know, the, the U.S. election is, is, is really uh, affecting ours in terms of the way it's being fought. But and why how does that bitter, affect And us? how bitter it is. Like, there's a bitterness in this country that makes me really sick. But Trudeau is saying that when he is saying Polyev is like the Trump of Canada. And Polyev is saying... That, tr that Trudeau is a wacko job and, is, and has ruined this country. I mean, he's saying exactly people, the same... A lot of people will say that. Well, he, but he's saying exactly the same, the same thing as Trump. These people are... He isn't saying they're communists, but he's saying they are ruining our country and, there's, and our country's deeply, deeply troubled thanks to Trudeau. But in Trudeau's your blog, responsible for everything. But in your blog, you say this country is very deeply wounded over the nine years of Trudeau. Well, yeah, it is, but is it all his fault? No, not everything's his fault, but a lot of the bad government we've had over the last years has been Trudeau's well, fault. Well, in, in any case, he's certainly being blamed, and the fact that he probably will be defeated is not going to solve anything. And, and the, the thought that, you know, the, the thought that ax the tax, build the homes, fix the budget, stop the crime, and bring it home, there's no content in that except that's what people tax. want. Ax the tax, stop the crime, stop the, you know, the, the bail you know, revolving door. They don't like the way Canada has become. No, that's true. Well, I mean, he's winning with that slogan. Okay, and, on uh, that, we have to stop. It's only three minutes, Patrick. I Another know, okay, one later on. sorry. Three minutes. To those of you who have subscribed and donated, a heartfelt thank you. You're keeping us on the air. If you're watching and you haven't, please try to do so because Four years ago, we started this show because there needed to be independent analysis. Now more than ever, with the Online Harms Act, once that gets into law, it's been passed once by the House, there are going to be hundreds of bureaucrats censoring the news in Canada, censoring this show. We need to keep it on the air. Thanks for your support. <laughs>